Hello, Antonio. This is Detective Michaels, and I'm Detective Brass. Hello, Antonio. Um, but you can call me Kim. Here's my badge. We want to talk to you about what happened tonight. Do you mind if I sit next to you? Okay. Well, first of all, I want to tell you that everything is going to be okay. I know you you've been through a lot tonight, Antonia. And I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for everything. Hey, um, guess what? There's one cool thing about me. I have two first names. Um, people that don't know me call me Kimberly. And, you know, people who know me, like my friends, they call me Kim. And I want you to be my friend. You can call me Kim. If you don't want to talk, maybe you can write it down or you can draw what's making you feel sad. Kim, can I see you outside for a moment, please? Sure. Okay, I'll be right back, okay, Tony? Let's try something new. What do you mean? I have something for you. What, what is it? Go on, take it. Where did you find this? It was with some of the items that were gathered from the crime scene that day. This was my mother's. I gave it to her on her birthday. I never thought I'd see this again. There's a photo in there. It's a little scratched out, but can you tell me who it is? No. It's my dad and me at the park. You look so happy there. Why did you do that to that photo? It used to be my favorite, but my opinion changed when I saw something I wasn't supposed to. What did you see? I don't remember all the details. Why don't you walk me through what you remember? I guess it all started one night when my dad came home after one of his drunk rampages after work. Uh -huh. He was so loud, he woke me and my sister up. So I thought, good, daddy's home. So I put on my sandals and I went into their room and and it's okay. You're doing great. And he was having... He was having sex with my mother, but... But she was crying and trying to get him off. Her screaming alone terrified me. Why? 
Why did it terrify you? Because I thought he was hurting her. I watched him drag her out of the room like yesterday's garbage and set her out in the yard to sleep. Okay? So stop worrying. Uh, look, I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. I... I ran to the kitchen because my sister was coming out of the bathroom. I heard my mom talking to her doctor. Were you listening to the details of that conversation? Kind of. I just remember her mentioning something about cancer. So I hid behind the couch. Why did you do that? I guess because I was scared. But I remember her going into the bedroom to tell my father. She was upset because she was sick and she was telling him that she was sick and he was yelling at her. She was sick and he was yelling at her like she did something wrong. Shut it! What? Just because you think what happened to Pedro and his whole will not happen to me! What are you talking about? I didn't sleep with anybody! I have kids, are you moron! Oh, you expect me to believe that after what you just told me about Linsomna? Or Linsomna, whatever you call it? Look, I don't have time to be dealing with your shit and my shit. I'm gonna give Tony your bath. Don't you walk away from me! Come on! Come on! You see you started? You can't stop, can ya? Is that the best you can do? Does that make you feel more like a man? Does it? Adele, you're garbage. You always were. Come on! Come on! Hey! Yeah, see? This is what we wanted! Bella! Bella, wake up! 
right to play the no! 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 Please stand up on my sister! Stop it! No, do you remember having yourself fun? Hey, do you? No! Fuck if I got him! If I got him! Oh, you're just jealous! I mean, you become a little slut! Jealous, you little... No! Ha, 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 ha. 